Okay, so first of all, I'm back. I was gone yesterday all day. Um, my mother is out of the hospital. She had a surgery yesterday morning and everything is fine. Um, um, I'll get more into that later, but um, I'm doing this quick, quick video before I get ready for work. So let's just get into it now. Lil Wayne, everybody mad with Lil Wayne at this point. Everybody mad with Lil Wayne because he said that he does not feel connected to the Black Lives Matter movement. Everybody mad with him. Here's what I got to say. Why y'all so fucking mad? And I mean, what I mean by why y'all so fucking mad is, why are y'all even, even fucking surprised by this? Like, really, Lil Wayne been the coon. So why the fuck y'all so surprised by that? That motherfucker don't give a fuck. He, he, all he cares about is being a damn skater boy, smoking weed, and being drunk all the fucking time. That's all the fuck he cares about. He don't give a fuck about this Black Lives Matter shit. He really sit up. He really sits up. I really honestly believe that Lil Wayne be in his own motherfucking world. I sincerely believe that. I believe that he be so fucking high that he don't even realize what the fuck been going on for the last few years with it. With these little boys, these little black guys getting shot up every other day. Like, I really believe that he don't even know what's going on because his dumb ass stay in his own little world, you know, sucking bird man dick and shit. You know, they going through their little divorce. So, my thing about it is, you black as hell and you come from humble beginnings yourself. So, how the hell would you not understand or not feel connected to the Black Lives Matter movement? You a black man. And people just like you are getting shot and killed for no fucking reason every day, but you don't feel connected to it. Hmm. But like I said, he's been a coon. Lil Wayne been cooning out ever since Lollipop. Lil Wayne been cooning out ever since he got a taste of that pop success and he's become mainstream. He's been a coon. And I haven't been a fan of his since then. But you know, there was a time whenever somebody said something about Lil Wayne, they'll get drugged for it. They acted like his ass was the Beyonce of rap at some point. You couldn't say nothing about Lil Wayne. I got a best friend that loved him some Lil Wayne. If I said one motherfucking word about Lil Wayne, he'll get mad and get ready to fight me. You know what I mean? Like, that's just how it used to be. And Lil Wayne is a coon. I've been saying this for I don't know how the fuck long this nigga is a coon. And so all this shit that y'all mad about regarding his comments about this, it does not surprise me nor does it faze me. He's a fucking coon. He is a damn coon for the wrong people. He's a fucking coon. And I hope that Birdman continues, continues to eat out of his motherfucking pocket. I hope he continues because... I just, I just feel like, just like when, when um, I don't know if that was Cam Newton or somebody else made the comment to say that he don't believe that there's no racism in the world. Racism ain't never left. It may have quieted down for a little while, but it ain't never left. And it's really come the fuck back up ever since George Zimmerman shot and killed Trayvon Martin and still got off. Racism is still alive, bitch. Little do you know. It's still fucking alive now. It is. And, um... I'm not even the type of nigga to get on camera and act like he woke and act like all this stuff because I'm not. I, I do ignorant shit too. You know what I'm saying? Like I like the ignorant shit on TV, the ignorant stereotypes that they put out there on reality TV and all that shit because I review it every motherfucking week. But all I got to say is it's stupid as hell for you to sit up here and say that you don't feel connected to the Black Lives Matter movement when people like you are getting killed. People like me and you are getting killed for no apparent reason. I don't Facebook live getting shot up for no motherfucking reason but you don't feel connected though you don't feel connected okay then will you feel connected if if white men was out here raping all black girls and shit like that and your daughter is black and she went through the same motherfucking trauma would you be connected to the shit then bitch you probably wouldn't be because you're too busy on your drugs and on your motherfucking alcohol that's what the fuck I believe. So with that being said, y'all, I just had to come in here and say that because a lot of y'all are really upset and a lot of y'all are really mad at this man. Why? He been a coon. I keep trying to tell y'all that. He been a motherfucking coon, y'all. What's so fucking surprising? What's the fucking breaking news? Because there ain't no breaking news over here. The bitch been a coon. Been one. And y'all just not realizing it? But okay. That's all I can say about that. But okay. I, 
I get the anger. I do understand. I get the anger. I get why y'all mad because he, he, you know, he doing that. But he been a fucking coon. He been not having no damn sense. He ain't nothing but another walk of flocking to me, to be quite honest. He been on some fuckery shit for a very long time now. You know what I mean? I was just, and, and everything he said in that interview was just ignorant. Everything he said in that interview was ignorant. Every motherfucking thing. I ain't no fucking politician. No, bitch, you not. Neither am I. But just recognize what the fuck is going on, bitch. Recognize that. You know what I mean? Ain't nothing wrong with recognizing the, the ways of the world today, bitch. Ain't nothing wrong with recognizing that shit. Recognize it. But don't act like ain't nothing going on. You know what I mean? Like, you know what's going on. But like I said, he might be in his own little purple haze ass world, not knowing what the fuck going on because all he cares about is weed and, and, and alcohol. That's all the fuck he cares about. But y'all, I just came up in here to rant about that. I mean, it's really ridiculous. Like, Lil Wayne is like, really? Who? Why would you? And y'all motherfuckers better not buy no more of his songs, no more of his album because that's what a god. I ain't bought shit from Lil Wayne since the block is hot and won't buy nothing else. So y'all better not buy shit else from Lil Wayne. Don't stream shit. Don't do nothing. He don't deserve nobody's support. Let him get the support from the white folks because that's what we cooning out for. And I'm not this bitch when I say that. Holla.